What's going on? I'm still on vacation in Jamaica. Here in Jamaica. Anyway, I saw this whole dust up with um, Aisha Curry, and I saw a whole bunch of people doing videos on it. And what she said did not surprise me, not even the least. Right? I'm trying to turn this radio off. It, it didn't surprise me, actually. Now, I'm going to hit three pointers. I'm hoping I don't stay too long on this, but have you ever noticed that you have females with short hair? They always want long hair, and then you have females with long hair. They're always trying to cut it short. Or you'll have a female with a short hair. She'll grow it long, and then she'll cut it short. They never know what they want. They never do. They're never happy with anything. Chris Rock did a stand-up. And he was talking about Barack Obama being president. And he said, can you imagine Barack Obama going home to Michelle Obama saying, hey, honey, you know, we won. No, I won. I'm the president. And he said that Michelle Obama would say, no, we is president. You know, what he was saying actually is that black women don't know how to stand back and let the man be the head. That's what he said, right? And the other point I want to make is I, 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 might, I might elaborate on these points if I have the time, but the other point I want to make is that I remember I met this I met, I met this female, it's, it's a white chick, a few years ago, about 10 years ago, and she told me that she was married, but she was unhappy, and she's getting a divorce. I asked her why, and she said that because she has been with her husband ever since she left high school. Yes, and she said that she has never felt any other dicks but his, and she wants to experience different dicks. Now let's get to Aisha Curry and her cry for attention. Now, it could be a case where she has only been with Steph Curry, just like the chick that I met 10 years ago. It could be a case where Aisha Curry has only been with Steph Curry, and being that Steph Curry is a basketball player, he's always in different cities, she probably feels neglected and she wants to experience different dicks. It could be that or she just wants to experience different dicks because, let's face it, a lot of females, if not all, and I'm just trying to be PC, they all go through their whole phase. Tarina, she talks about it. They go through a time when they just want to be having sex. Yes. And you have a lot of females who they get married very quickly so they didn't get a chance to party, you know, experience different guys, to find out what they want, who they want, and stuff like that. And then, to take it back to the hair scenario, the long hair, short hair that I mentioned, women are confused. They never know what they want. You know, women, why do you think a lot of women are in church? And they make Jesus their husband. Because they're seeing this image of Jesus as being powerful and loving and all of these things. And they can't get all of that here on earth because we're not perfect as human beings. So you find that women try to have like three different guys. One to make them laugh, one to pay the bills, and one to dig out their pussy. You know, to tear that ass up. So they find that in Jesus, except that Jesus can't have sex with them. So you get where I'm going? So it could be a case now where Aisha Curry, she's confused because now she has a guy who provides for her, but maybe he's not, he's not tearing that ass up. It could be. 
Or it could be that she has what she always wanted, but now she is seeing other women getting other attention and she wants all that attention too. And the other point that I made was with the Chris Rock situation and Obama and Michelle. Obama says, I'm president. Michelle Obama says, no, we are president. Now, I've seen quite a few people say that it could be a case where uh, Aisha Curry is jealous of Steph Curry. And that could be true. That could be true. Because I find that most women who are married to celebrities, they want the attention too. They want the celebrities to put them out there, which is why I keep warning these guys, when you become a celebrity, stop putting your woman out there. Because women cannot go back in lifestyle. So when you introduce them to a certain lifestyle, they're not going to go back. So just look at Karuchi Chan and what's his name? Chris Brown. I did a video on that. Chris Brown put her out there. Nobody knew who Karuchi Tran was. When he put her out there, she got a taste of all that fame and attention. She couldn't go back, and he eventually lost her, regardless of what he probably did to lose her. Look at, what's his name, Shaq, and his ex-wife, Shawnee. He gave her that, the, um, the fame. He's the one who gave her that fame. When you become a celebrity, or if you're a celebrity as a guy, you have to keep your woman in the background. Do not let them force you or guilt you into making them famous because you will regret it. Because they will get so much attention, they're going to want more. And you will be the guy who was on the inside, now on the outside looking in. damn cop.